Welcome back to Tiger Vision News for Wednesday, October 21st. I'm Sophie and this is my co-host, Brinkley. Thanks for joining us today. Students are really having fun in their reading classes. The fun is part of a project they've all been working on. Check it out. Hi, I'm Aubrey here with... Mrs. Harris. Tell us about the poetry books your students worked on. Uh, well, this was kind of a summative project that we were working on um, that related to the crossover. Uh, the crossover had a really strong theme of identity, and so we wanted to give our students a chance to um, kind of show that in their own writing, and so we chose to do this poetry book. And uh, each of their poems were supposed to relate to their own identity, and they were supposed to follow the format in the poetry that was in the crossover. So each different poem was kind of a different type of poem in that book, and so they emulated that. Uh, how many students created them? Uh, all of our students did them, and it was, a, it was quite an undertaking. <laughs> what is the next big assignment for your students? Uh, well, this week we're working on evidence-based writing, and um, they're working to kind of figure out how to formulate a claim, and um, learning about counterclaims, and just generally argumentative writing. So they're working on that essay now. Thank you. Thanks. I'm Blister with Madison. Addison. Melody. Tell us about your poetry books. Um, it was hard to come up with the ideas of what to write about. It really caused me to have to think about myself. It was fun to do. What was your favorite thing about the project? Learning more about my life than I have already known. Getting to know myself better and think about myself. I guess writing. Thank you. Thanks for the interview. We'll be back after this. Can I have our beer room? One dollar, please. There you go. Make sure to put it in the box. Thank you. Welcome back to Tiger Vision News. Here's a look at a few things this week that you'll want to make note of. Everyone looks great dressed up today. We've seen lots of athletes and scholars running around the halls today. Friday is Decades Day. Find an outfit from your favorite decade and dress up. We'll be out roaming the halls looking for the coolest costumes we can find. Dress up, it's going to be fun. We're also going to be able to dress up this Halloween. Costumes will be allowed this year as long as they're school appropriate and they fit in with the twin day theme. Hey, the band's fall concert is next week. They'll be performing all day during school. We're going to try and record the show and then post it to our YouTube channel. That way everyone can watch. Don't miss it. Now let's see what's going on in weather. Hi, I'm Grayson with your Tiger Vision News today. Current conditions are going to be 74, cloudy, south 14 miles per hour, precipitation is 10%. Um, today's regional forecast is kind of warm in our area. Now let's see what's going on in sports. Hello FMS Sports fans, I'm Kayla and this is Addie. Here's a look at today's sports. Today everyone on the cross country team have their next meet. Let's check, at, let's check in with a few of them. I'm Brady Him here with Coach G. When were the next meets? We've uh, Wednesday. At, they changed it actually to the ninth grade center. How do you think we will do it? I think we'll do solid. We've done pretty good. We've got a lot of medals and placed pretty high, so I think we'll do a pretty good job. Who do you think is faster, Sky Zint, Spencer McMahon, or Forrest Gump? They're both really fast, but I don't think anyone's going to take Forrest down. I don't think that's much of a race, honestly. Thank you. Thanks. The meet is at the ninth grade center and starts at 5. Do your best today, Tigers! Members of the FMS tennis team wrapped up their fall season yesterday. They did really well and are ready for any tournaments if they're scheduled. We'll keep you updated on the story. Hey, did you know we have a girl playing on our football team? Yeah, it's Jade. She's the first ever girl to play, to play football at Friendship Middle School. Let's go find out more about her. Hi, I'm Blessed and this is Jade Moran. Is it true you're the first ever girl football player to, at FMS? Uh, yes. What do you like most about football? Um, I like building a bond with the guys and mainly just having fun. What team are you on? I'm on C team. What position do you play? Um, I play cornerback and wide receiver and corner. Thank you. Keep up the hard work, Jay. The girls on both 7th and 8th volleyball teams play their next games tomorrow night. They play the girls from Talkington and Willie McCool here on our home courts. Be sure to go watch if you can get a voucher. Good luck, girls. That's a look at today's sports. Back, Back to, to you. you. That's all we have today.